Printing checks in QuickBooks Desktop, how to adjust the alignment. Hey everybody, this is Matt Holquist with the QuickBooks University. And I want to put together this video. It's simple, but it's, I get this question so much from members and, and people that watch YouTube videos. Uh, and it's making sure when you print a check from QuickBooks that the alignment is right. You know, so you print a check and the numbers might be like outside the box of your pre-printed check stock, or maybe the the who you make the check out to is too high, too low, too left, too right. And so I'm gonna show you in this video how to align, how to adjust that alignment so that you get them to print uh, the correct way each and every time. So here we are on the home screen, okay? So when you have gone through and you have, you know, paid bills or maybe and said, you know, print later, checks, print later. And you go up to this file drop down menu and you go down to print forms, you go to checks. So you want to print your checks. And I always tell people, you know, before you go and print a bunch of checks, because let's say you're printing like 10, 15, 20 checks at one time and they all get messed up. You know, you got to go through and basically uh, void them or avoid the print and then print it again so that those check numbers uh, don't get uh, used again. So test it out first. So first of all, go to printer setup right here under the file drop down menu printer setup and you want to choose check. OK, now the form name, you've got the settings. And so you're going to check or check your uh, check style and you've got your fonts so you can change the fonts and the address font and you've got your partial page so if you're just printing partial checks okay so i'm not going to go through all those settings right now but i want you to look over here on the right and you've got a button that says align so we're going to click on that button and you're going to see this come up it says find alignment the first thing you want to do is you want to print a sample okay so when you print the sample here's what that is going to look like it's going to print this uh, sample check on a blank sheet of paper and what you want to do is you want to put this behind your check stock hold it up to a light and make sure that it lines up where it's supposed to line up all right now if you need to make adjustments because i can tell you like nine times out of ten right out of the box it's not going to line up so if you need to make adjustments what you're going to do is let's go back over to quickbooks and if you need the uh, typed words and numbers to go up, all right, you want to do this, just go up. Now these are one one hundredths of an inch, each one of these. So they are pretty small adjustments. Okay, so you do this for up, you do this for down, and then horizontally, if you need it to go left, you do that way. If you need it to go right, you do this way. And then you're going to print the sample again and hold it up to your check. Uh, hold it behind the check up to a light and make sure that it lines up. And you just keep making these adjustments until you get it to where it's right and where it looks good. And then you click OK. And then you uh, save this. You hit OK here. And then you can go to print your checks. Load them in the printer. And you print them and they should come out right. So you'll save yourself a lot of headache if you do this on the front end before you start printing a bunch of checks because it is a pain in the butt if they all come out wrong and you don't want to have them returned by the bank because they don't line up for some reason and you got to go back through and reprint all those checks and basically void those check numbers that printed wrong. Hopefully this is helpful. Any questions, any comments, feel free to leave those below. Also head over to the QuickBooks University at qbuniversity.org.